Okay. This is something called bad news. Uh, it's a general reading. Somebody didn't want this reading, so we get the benefit off the messages and lessons it teaches us. <laughs> so people need to start paying for readings. These things are pretty good. Okay. Um, we have flag. Um, do not be tempted to lower your standards. We have younger man dealings or relationship with a younger man. We have not. We have unsuccessful plans. We have casket. Somebody is going out of your life or the end of the situation. We have dogs getting together with friends. We have lightning. Control your anger or you will be sorry. We have a cup. You should accept valid criticism. We have a hammock. Taking a vacation physically or mentally. We have target. We have a goal-oriented person. We have a dagger. Uh, fear, worries, or tense situations. We have a purse. Pay attention to your finances. We have a lobster. We have financial pinch. All right. This is only a three-card reading, so we'll see. Three questions. All right, we have money. All right. Uh, so old lovers together, waters of the past, mirror of reflection, memories, reconciliation, or reminiscing. Um filter of the mind. We have childhood love. And then we have career. Uh, mass of attachment uh, represents own fears, deepest thoughts that are hiding. We have the number 72. So that could be somebody's number too. Um, let's see what message that is. Maybe it has something for somebody that's actually listening to this right now. Um, we have love here. So we have a woman over the age of 40, softness and control, energy, life, um, mystical love, a caring soul, truce, um, like energy, offer of love and marriage, we have concealed. So somebody is concealing the fact that they are married or they want to get married. Or maybe they have, maybe they're attracted to somebody else. And they want to get married to that person. And the person that they're with is kind of like, you know, not what who they originally wanted. I guess it was kind of like, damned if you do, damned if you don't situation. And the person that they really wanted, they, they didn't have the balls to go and talk to them. I don't know. Only time will tell. Um, but anyway, hopefully you grow some balls and you go talk to this person. Um... Uh, I always hate it when people like stall and things like that. They need to just go and talk to people, you know, because at least you'll know where you stand with this person. If they don't like you, they can tell you to shove off or like, you know, move your ass to the other direction. But like people just like want that stimulation of maybe it'll happen, you know, which it never does because like they don't have the balls to do anything about it. So it just goes by the wayside. Anyway, hopefully this helps somebody out, grow a pair. The worst thing they can say is no, or ew. Um, but <laughs> really, you, you'll probably be better off depending on how violent or how they react to your question. So, it depends. I'm, I'm a glass half full person, so just, just go ask. If they don't like you, then they don't like you. There's nothing I can do about that. But if there's a chance, you might actually have a good chance. You never know. Anyway, I'll see you later. Bye.